What's up, everybody, and welcome to the Russell Street Riot. I'm Matt Costantini. It's about that time when you get to make decisions that will stick with you all year. Decisions that non-football fans, if they still exist, never have the opportunity to experience. You're constructing your fantasy team. Your fantasy football team is going to consume the majority of your life for the next half of a year. You better make it good. If you want player advice, go find that glorified weather forecaster, Matthew Berry. I'm talking about the draft day experience. Here's some of my do's and don'ts for your draft this year. Number one, draft in person. I know that technology has allowed all of us to connect with other people from all over the world and use that reach to troll Paul George via Twitter, but drafting in person is nothing but upside. This gives you an incredible excuse to smash a 12-pack of Oktoberfest on a random Tuesday night and tell your friend how much you hate him for reaching on Zach Stacy and blowing up your master draft plan. Oh, I know. Look how good my lineup is. Nobody cares. Number two, don't be the comatose fantasy GM. You know the guy in your league that when it becomes his turn to draft, he's still just staring at everyone, has no idea it's even his turn to pick. Dude, we all know you're going to draft your fifth receiver in the sixth round. Grab a running back, fool. Why is it that a dozen other guys don't need a pick clock, but when you come up, we realize that we need to set the microwave timer? We sentence you to pick a player from Jacksonville. Everybody wants to kick this guy out of the draft every year, but it's a guaranteed win every week, and you can't have a decent league with 11 guys. Number three, set your lineup. Yeah, we get it. You lost three of your first four, your team's awful, and you're packing it in. But have some respect for the game. I'm trying to get the first overall seed here, and the other guy is up against your bye week roster. You're the worst. You're worse than the girl in the league that drafted Texans D in the fourth round because she likes their colors, that guy with the long hair in the fifth round, and Justin Tucker in the third because he's hot. You know what? Well, in that case... I'm going to draft Catherine Webb as my quarterback, the Cowboys cheerleaders as my defense, and Justin Tucker. What? He's dreamy. Check out these videos and more on RussellStreetReport.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel for new Russell Street rides every week.